glad to have you with us in the studio. I'm Reese Davis, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. San Diego State looked almost unbeatable the last few weeks. They're finally playing the way they knew they could before the season started. You know how this game is. You're only as good as your last one. They're going to have to prove it on the field again today. We've done all we can do here. Time to tee it up. Let's send it out to Brad and Kirk for the call. David and I will be with you at halftime. San Diego State is kicking off first, and we're ready to get this game underway. He just drills this one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. stop at the 35 yard line that one's more than good enough for the first half well brad that is a great play by the quarterback to find his target past the marker to keep this drive moving first down 10 yards to go ball on the 35 yard line here's the toss nothing to it that is exactly the type of play that good linebackers make on a regular basis and if you can make enough of them in college probably going to get a chance to play at the next level like that. The linebacker was determined to get the ball there, and he did. So the offense will come out for their first possession. Good field position for their first possession of the ball game. Let's see if they can capitalize off of it. Tackle made at the 14. San Diego State's got a guy that statistically is leading the conference right now. And he has got the attention of everybody in the country, including the coordinator. From the 14-yard line, it's second down. Quick to the receiver, falls incomplete. Sure, it's disappointing, but this is the kind of mechanical flaw you can fix with practice and coaching. Gets it, he's in space. He's tackled at the seven yard line. Nice gain, but not enough for the first down. Yeah, that's a nice play there. They did everything right except get enough yards for the first down. Fourth down, and the offense is still on the field. Let's go! 
finds his receiver. Touchdown. Fired it out to his wide receiver, who made the grab and got the score. When this guy's got time to throw, he makes the defense pay. They rolled the dice and went for it on fourth, and I'm sure they're happy with the result. And he adds the extra point. Let's throw it out to Reese now for a studio update. Let's take a look at some action in the Big 12. This game was so tight, every play seemed to be of the utmost importance. The Red Raiders get it done by two. Meanwhile, the Hurricanes and Gators in the battle for the Seminole War Canoe. And for Florida, they've now dropped three in a row. Miami takes the W by a deuce. Thanks, Reese. 7-0 game here. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He sends this one deep. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So the Aztecs are right where they want to be early in this one, partner. Well, this is what their coach talked about, getting off to a great start. The defense did their job, and it's nice to see the offense move the ball down the field and also get some points on the board. The defense was able to stop this offense short on fourth down last time. Let's see what they do this opportunity. Brad, this offense, the last time they were out there, went for it on fourth down and came up short. And I'm all for being aggressive. But I really think you've got to be smart when it comes to when to go fourth down and when to punt and try to affect field position. Let's see if this offensive coordinator and play caller has learned from some of his mistakes in the past. From their own 38-yard line, it's first down. He's taken down around the 37-yard line. Chucks it downfield. That's a great tackle at the 31 yard line. Well, I tell you, these guys have some skill players who can make things happen. They picked up an enormous amount of real estate on that play. It's first down and 10 now after picking up some great yardage through the air. So they run the same pass play again. Yeah, typically you'll see this when teams are having success with a particular player. They feel confident about a play's chances. They'll bring him down at the 28-yard line. Third down, and they need to get it to the 21. at about the 15-yard line. Getting him the ball in the passing game creates real havoc for the defense. There aren't many linebackers who can stay with him in coverage, that's for sure. He gets out to about the 12-yard line. From the 12 yard line, second down. He's got it out to his tight end. A huge play and a great position to score. That makes it first and goal. And this is the ninth play of the current drive. You've got to 
give each of these guys credit for getting in sync, really fighting to create that touchdown. The extra point to tie this game up. And he tacks on the extra point. A nine-play, 74-yard drive. And they add seven points to the scoreboard. We're even at seven in this one. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. It's fielded at the two. And he's tackled at the 28. Their last drive ended with a touchdown. Let's see what happens on this possession. Well, it's one thing to have speed. It's another thing to have an idea of what you're doing and how to attack the defense. And right now, these wide receivers clearly have done an outstanding job in being able to make their reads and getting out of their breaks, and the quarterback put the ball right on the line. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Zips it to the tight end, and down he goes at the 40. So at the end of one, we get a tie game at 7-7. We're ready for more football here in quarter number two. He gets out to about the 42-yard line. From their own 42-yard line, it's second down. Gives it right side. He fights forward to about the 43. That makes it 37. And that one's incomplete. There's one the quarterback would like to rewind because he has a wide open receiver and he just misfires. That brings us fourth and seven. Moore is waiting for the snap. He makes it out to maybe the 30-yard line. They've been like a couple of fighters feeling each other out so far. Let's see if they start to open it up a little bit more now. Makes the catch and gets out of bounds. It's a great job here by the quarterback of recognizing the outside linebacker blitz and delivering the football for a first down. From their own 43-yard line, first down. the catch and look out he's at the 40 he's pushed out of bounds at the 39 yard line flag down and i'm not sure when it was thrown let's find out so they'll move back after that costly penalty and they'll have to try to get that yardage back here from their own 40 yard line second down Slings it. And he's taken down around the 48-yard line. The quarterback and his receiver make a great play here and convert on an early down. So it's third down, and they've got about two yards to go. And he's 
tackled after positive yardage. Call it a gain of seven yards. That makes it first and ten. D-line did a good job of nullifying out the blocks up front, and that allowed the linebacker to roam free and make the tackle in the backfield. So it's second and 13. Ball on the 45. Gets rid of it quickly, and that was almost picked. You like a team that's ready to defend the pass. It takes some preparation to get in the way of a pass like that. Quick out to his receiver. Drop down at about the 41. Schmidt is the putter. is into the end zone and this will be a touchback this is the point in the game where you don't want to make any mistakes that give the other guys a reason to feel more confident going into halftime they'll spread the field with five wide Got it. and he goes down quickly everything about that play was crisp the route the throw the catch that's fun to see they're about four yards away here on second down On the give, and he's tackled around the 27-yard line. Six-yard line. First down. He's got to throw it in a hurry. Fires that quickly incomplete. Well, he must have hurried there because his receiver was wide open. There was no need to rush that one at all. Him hard at the 50 yard line. Baldwin makes the tackle. 50 yard line. Completes it and he's hit hard immediately. We played a half. We're even at seven in this one. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Bruce Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. These two defenses so far, they've been everything they've been advertised to be. 
They've stopped the run. They've limited the passing game. They apply pressure at the right time. It's going to be hard to find holes to move the ball at all in the second half. Yeah, and sometimes it's really bad offense. And sometimes you can also look at those holes and they come open and all of a sudden they close really fast. And, and that's what you're seeing. A lot of guys that are really athletic, really fast. They know where to be. A lot of guys that you'll be seeing playing on Sundays. I mean, it's just a lot of talent to overcome and you got to be in the right position, but then you got to beat those great players that are also in the right position. So I, I expect more of the same, but you know, which team can break through and make a huge play to, to take the other one, you know, off guard a little bit and make that big play. That's going to do it at halftime. Just about ready to start the second half. All right, you finish it up, bro. I'm going to get some of the cafeteria. I'm hungry. Wait, wait, wait don't leave until you get my order. Brad Kirk, take the second half. Heading into the third quarter now. Tie ball game as we're set to resume play. Marshall fields it at the one. Gets to about the 24-yard line. Now's when you start to approach each drive thinking that if you take the lead, then the momentum you gain feels that much more powerful. And they make the stop at the 22. That'll bring up second and 12. Second and 12 coming up here. Ball on the 22. Mike 22, he's coming. 22 is coming. Mike, Mike. Ready. Green on cut. He makes his way to about the 32. the 47 yard line. That'll bring up third and two. They'll line it up again on third down. Steps up. He's tackled at the 41. down 10 to go ball on the 26 yard line Ready. they work the right side and there is nothing going there that makes it second and 10. we're at play number nine of this current drive defense of getting after that quarterback and right now I think they've got him with some happy feet he appears to be a bit rattled third down and they need to get it to the 15.
second down at the 19. San Diego State could take the lead with this field goal. The kick is up, and he got it. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He sends this one deep. He's to the 20. Tackle made at the 32. Fred, everywhere we go when we travel all over the country, people want to talk about offense. Oh, the spread or the pistol. Hurry up, tempo offense and points. It's nice to watch a team that prides itself on playing great defense. And when it's all said and done, the teams that advance and get to the important bowl games and do well in the postseason are teams that have this kind of defense. He makes it to the 32-yard line. From their own 32-yard line, it's second down. Good tackle there in space. Jacobson makes the tackle at the 44-yard line. First down. They'll bring him down at the 47. From their own 47-yard line, second down. Hands off left, and he's brought down quickly. Strike to the receiver. Tackle at the 39. First down. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 39. That's three down and one to go. San Diego State's got a three point lead. Just about set to start action here again in the fourth quarter. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. That's good for a game of seven yards. That'll bring up second and three. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. And this play is number eight on the drive. He zips it out to the right. Goes complete. He's got room to work. He's out of bounds at about the 11. That makes it first and 10. It's first and ten. Ball on the 11. They go with a screen here, and the halfback's got it. And down he goes, around the 10-yard line. This is the 10th play of this drive.
and he converts the extra point. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Clancy takes it from the six. And he's taken down at the 26-yard line. This is a pretty crucial series right here. With things being so tight, your backers have to step it up on both sides of the ball. Nice run there. Tailback picked up seven on the draw. So it's second down and about two yards to go. the defensive coordinator came up with here. They were all over the place on that play and left the quarterback nowhere to throw it. Less than three minutes in the game. to go. Ball on the 49. Here we go. He might not be able to get the pass off. And he's hit before he could go anywhere. Tough throw on the run and cuts. So it's complete, but they didn't get much there. And that's because the defense was just waiting on it and they attacked. The quarterback should have found somebody else downfield. and 10. Ball on the 39-yard line. Good outside run there. First time out of the half. And he picked up almost four on that halfback delay. Tenth play of the drive. Defense in their short yardage packet. Touchdown, and they take the lead. San Diego State staff, they've got to love the fact that they've got this kid in this situation week in and week out. Yeah, I mean, they know that when the chips are on the table, they've got to find a way to get him his touches, and this time he steps up in a big way for the touchdown. So the kicker will line up here and try to give his team a three-point lead with this extra point. And he hits the PAT. Williams ready to kick. Diggs fields it at the two. He 
Chase tackle at the 23-yard line. San Jose State's ranking, that doesn't mean anything right now. Now, they've not played up to their expectations at all, but they have the football here late in the game. They're very fortunate to still have a chance to maybe win it because they've not looked like themselves. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Fires quickly to the tight end. Brought down at the 49. Big game there for the first down. There was some miscommunication down there by the defense that allowed for that big game. First and 10. Ball on the 49. Under a minute left. He's on the run. He's at the 40. And he's tackled at the 32-yard line. San Jose State will have one timeout remaining. Second and ten. Ball on the 32. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. From the 15-yard line, first down. Caught out of the open, and he's level at the 12. Spikes the ball. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Touchdown! And now they're winning this ball game.
Penalty markers down. They took too much time. Offense. And he adds extra points. They're lined up to kick, and they might just kick it short and prevent a long return. He'll return it from the three. They'll bring him down at the 34-yard line. Late in the fourth quarter in a one-possession game. And poise is what it's all about here. Who's going to have it and who won't? One last play. It's time to find out how far he can throw it and see if this game becomes one of the all-time greatest. Here we go. Oh, and he can't hold on. It's final. A close one to the very end. 21 San Jose State. Kirk, go ahead and just give us your reflections on this game. Oh, there's no doubt about it. This was a huge upset, and there's no one to blame but themselves. San Diego State came into this football game a little bit cocky, and in all honesty, I don't think they're very well prepared. I think this game will teach them a lesson that you can't just show up and expect to win. That's it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Kirk Street, I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you soon.